Now it's story time on Noggin. The story of Mei Lin and the Magic Paintbrush. In China, there once lived a young field worker named Mei Lin who dreamed of being a great artist. But he was so poor, he could not buy a brush to paint with. One night, he was visited by an old wizard. You have worked very hard, and you have earned this, he said, handing Mei Lin a beautiful brush. Use it wisely, said the wizard, for it has great power. On his wall, Mei Lin painted a rooster. Suddenly, the rooster leapt off the wall and flew away. It was a powerful brush indeed. The next day, Mei Lin came upon a farmer struggling to plow his rice paddy. With his brush, he painted a water buffalo to pull the plow, and Mei Lin used the brush to help many others. When the greedy Mandarin, who ruled the land, heard of the magic brush, he ordered Mei Lin to paint him a pile of coins. Mei Lin refused, and the Mandarin threw him in jail. That night, Mei Lin used his magic brush to draw a door and escape. But soon the Mandarin caught Mei Lin. This time, he took the brush away. But in his greedy hands, the brush was useless. The Mandarin handed the brush to Mei Lin. Paint me a mountain of gold. Mei Lin painted a mountain of gold in the middle of a great sea. He painted a ship to take the Mandarin to the mountain. When the Mandarin reached the gold, Mei Lin painted a dark cloud, which brought a great storm, destroying the boat and leaving the greedy Mandarin trapped forever, all alone on top of his mountain of gold. Mei Lin had used the brush wisely, indeed. That's the end of the well-known story of Mei Lin and the Magic Paintbrush. But then what happened? That's Lee made up a story. Well, what she thinks happened next. I did visit a sea, and this is what I think happened to the boy in the magic paintbrush. The boy painted a very ground, and he and his mom and dad went up and down on it. And they went, wee! He painted a huge gigantic ice cream cones for them, and then they licked it. And it was yum. They had a party before they left, and they danced. And then they lived happily ever after. That's the story of Mei Lin and the Magic Paintbrush. And that's Ashley's story of what happened next. You can imagine what happened next, too. Go to noggin.com to make up your own story. <laughs>